Before I begin, did you know that there are 9.9 .9 million single mothers living in the U.S. today that are raising children under the age of 18? So sad. I was raised in a single parent home. My dad was vacant. He was basically a deadbeat. We were poor, raised in the ghetto. You know, with all of that, my mom did a great job always making me feel like everything was going to be okay, even when it wasn't. The purpose of this video is I want to let all those of you people that can relate to me, whether your dad passed away, or he was a deadbeat like my dad. Unfortunately, my dad was a qualifies both. He's a deadbeat and he passed away. Everything's gonna be okay. That's one. Two, success can be hard. Success brings failure. But the biggest key to all of that is never giving up. The most successful people in this world failed a million times before they succeeded. That's actually normal. When I lost 60 pounds, I failed several times, but I never gave up and I finally lost the 60 pounds. You get my drift? So whatever you want to do in life, don't ever look back and say, well, my dad or even my mom failed miserably in being in my life. Therefore, every time I fail, I'm just going to point my finger at them. No, every time you fail, you have to point the finger at yourself and figure out what you need to do different to help you get past that. But to succeed, one of the biggest things is finding a mentor. Yo, Ainge where I'm gonna find the mentor, all the people I'm around are unsuccessful, blah, 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 blah. Great question, answer. We live in a tech world where literally everything's in the palm of your hand. I like to think of Google as my stepmother and YouTube as my dad. Because whenever I have a question, I most likely 100% of the time can't get an answer from. YouTube physically shows me, Google, I can read on it. Just FYI, I'm not trying to be a motivational speaker. I'm just expressing my feelings on the camera. But overall, guys, if you're fatherless like myself, don't let it stop your grind. Don't allow that past of yours to, or even your present to affect your life because at the end of the day, like I told you before, you are behind that steering wheel and you are in control of your destiny. All right, guys.